Hi, I'm Captain Al Martinez. In this edition of Blackboard, I'm gonna to talk to you about ropes for tying off equipment. On arrival, the firefighter will deploy the hose line in a matter of an 100 foot coupling is just below where the hose line is to be hoisted. Once the firefighter gets the hose line out of the way, the captain will then proceed to the BA compartment, grab his BA, don it, go get a high-rise pack to ensure we have adequate hose. The captain will then place the high-rise pack nearby and wait for the drawback. The firefighter can anchor the drawback at the railing by using the carabiner or by using a slip knot or a girth hitch at the doorknob of the adjacent unit. Our department manuals call for a slip knot six feet down the line, a half hitch six inches from the coupling, and another half hitch six inches from the tip. It is recommended that the last half hitch is placed through the back of the shutoff and around the tip to keep the nozzle shot while hoisting. The disadvantage of this method is that it's time consuming for the firefighter at the fire floor to take the whole system apart. A quicker option is to simply tie a girth hitch and slide it through the back of the shutoff and around the tip. This method also keeps the nozzle shut. It's strong enough to hold the hose if it were to get charged and it's quick to take off. After tying the hose line, the captain will pick up the pack and proceed to meet the firefighter at the fire floor. He will place the high-rest pack in a location for easy access in case it's needed and assist the firefighter in flaking the hose. Once the line is ready, the firefighter will host the line. He will place the nozzle in the direction of the fire. Using the hose strap, the firefighter will place a girth hitch behind the 50-foot coupling and another girth hitch the same way a ladder is tied off around the railing. If there is no railing on the fire floor, the firefighter can tie another girth hitch around the doorknob of the adjacent unit to secure the hose. Once the hose is flaked, both will down their PPE and initiate fire attack. <laughs> 